What is going on guys? Devin is here and welcome to my 2018 gaming slash room setup. Let's not talk about anything else because that's not why y'all are here. Y'all are here to see my room and my setup. So starting out, we have a dresser from Walmart. But on top of that, it's just some basic stuff. I got my watch here that I got for Christmas. I got my hat that I got for Christmas. And I got this uh, thing that I got after my graduation that my grandparents bought me. And over here, I got a little cap, graduation cap that my girlfriend bought me. I can store stuff in it, put pictures in it. It's pretty cool. And just doesn't deodorant and clone. And then I got my baseball. Uh, I got this a couple years ago. Not a couple years ago, about five years ago when I played baseball. Uh, went to the World Series with my team and we got eliminated and we got a ball and uh, everyone signed it and they gave it to me. So I just kept it and I put it in a frame and uh, I just leave it here for memories because those were the good days. But over here, I know, I know it's January. Why do you still have your Christmas tree up? Because my girlfriend bought me this tree and she doesn't want me to take it down yet so i'm not going to take it down because i'm going to keep her happy but that's the tree and i got a little heater here to stay toasty into winter time believe it or not that little heater puts out a lot of heat like i could have it running for about five minutes and i'm already sweating and over here got my futon that no one sits on it's just here for looks uh my intention whenever i bought this I was like, you know what, I'm going to have a lot of friends over, we're going to watch the game, going to have chill, going to have some fun, but no, uh, that's not how it turned out. I literally have, I have literally had two people sit on this, me and my girlfriend, uh, but for about five minutes and we got off and left. So this is, thing is just sitting here, I'm probably going to sell it or move it, I don't know, it looks cool in my room though. I almost fell over my fan. But anyway, this is my coffee table that I built in carpentry class uh, a couple years ago when I was still in high school. Uh, it took me about three to four days to build, and I'm extremely happy how it turned out. This was my first major build in carpentry class. Uh, I was used to building bird houses and all that stuff, but I decided I wanted to build a table. That way I didn't have to buy one, and it actually turned out really good. Uh, I was extremely happy. And it saved me a whole lot of money, honestly. And then over here, got just a regular old bed. And I got some, I got an emoji pillow, a kissy face that my girlfriend got me. And she also bought me a squid stuffed animal. She asked me and she was like, I'm about to buy you a stuffed animal. Uh, what do you want? And I told her a squid. And she looked at me like I was stupid. She said, why do you want a squid? And I was like, because I think they're pretty cool. And she's like, you gotta be kidding me. And so she bought me the squid, and now every time she comes over, she doesn't even want to look at the squid for some reason. Like, it's just a stuffed animal. Like, come on now. Really? But making my way over here, just got a regular old fan, a box fan. Uh, stay chill in the, in the summer, summertime, I guess. And over here, got my jersey uh, from going to the World Series. Uh, that's pretty cool. I'm wanting to hang it on the wall. But as you can see, my wall is literally four foot tall because the way my room is. I'm above the garage, so it's like it's like a slanted ceiling, and it sucks because I always hit my head if I go too far. I hate it. And then over here, you got my entertainment part, center section, I guess. Uh, got a 49-inch TV from Insignia, I believe. Yeah. 49 inch TV from Insignia, uh, it's a really good TV, and my cable provider, which is Comcast, they have YouTube, Netflix, Pandora, they have all that, so I don't have to hook any console up to it or anything to watch YouTube or Netflix, and I really enjoy that, but I barely use this TV, honestly. I only bought it that way whenever I bought a house, uh, I wouldn't have to buy one, because I'm kind of in the process of looking around for apartments and houses, so... Just trying to get everything now, that way I don't have to buy it later. And down here, I got a sound bar that my brother gave me. Shout out to him, he knows who he is, he's watching this. Uh, really enjoy that. He gave it for me 
for my birthday, I believe, or Christmas last year. I can't remember, honestly. But here is the part that y'all are here for, my setup. But first, here's my chair. So this chair got it at Office Depot, I believe, uh, three years ago when I first started this setup for $100. And it's, it's done a good job. It really has. It's really comfortable and I really love it, but I'm looking to upgrade to a DX Racer soon, so this chair will not be used anymore. I'm probably gonna throw it out the window. But, oh, there's my floor. Oh, I hate being upstairs. But anyway, I'm gonna sit in my chair and show y'all everything. Uh, here is my Xbox One S. Uh, I don't even play console that much anymore unless it's to just play 2K or play Fortnite and chill with some of my old friends. Uh, I got a pop vinyl up there i think his name is soap or something like that i just got it because it was call of duty and i really enjoy call of duty but uh yeah that's my xbox don't i haven't turned it on in a good three days four days five days but anyway here is my xbox one controller that i have hooked up to my pc for whenever i play gta or something uh, like that that way i ain't got to use mouse and keyboard and then there's a picture of me and my girlfriend but here is my keyboard. Move this mic out of the way. Here's my keyboard. It is the Razer Ornata, I think. Yeah, Ornata Chroma. Chroma. Oh my God. Chroma. And I have it set to green. Uh, I really enjoy this keyboard. I really love it. It's my favorite keyboard I've ever had. And it also has this magnetic uh, wrist pad. And it's really comfortable. I really love it. And then over here, got my Razer Death Adder mouse. I uh, really, really love this mouse, honestly. I was looking to get another one, but I just couldn't because I really love this mouse. And then my mouse pad is the Razer Goliath extended mouse pad. Uh, shout out to my brother again. Bought it for Christmas. Bought it for me for Christmas this year. Uh, really love this mouse pad, honestly. Love it. I'm a Razer fanatic, if you guys can't tell. But anyway, here is my mic. Uh, it is the Blue Yeti, and I painted it black and green to match my setup, and I got this pop filter with a Inogear Gear mic arm, uh, so I can just, no, I'll just hit my monitor, whoops. But anyway, uh, let's get on to my monitors. My monitors are two ultra wides, they're LG 25 inch, uh, I overclocked the left one to 75 hertz because that is my gaming one and my right one is still just at 60 hertz because that's my productivity but i really do love these monitors but i'm looking to upgrade again to uh two gaming monitors and one ultra wide in the middle because that's i have a corner desk and i have room for it so why not why not go overkill and get three monitors uh but that's my monitors uh and over here all right guys i am a harry potter fanboy i really am i got two pop vinyls i got harry potter and i got snape uh i think these are really cool i love pop vinyls i'm looking to start a collection of them uh hopefully but i don't know where i'm gonna put them uh but anyway up here i got a harry potter uh patronum yeah patronum uh little uh canvas about it at GameStop it's really cool it lights up and it it's touch uh to turn off and turn on but you got to smack it and every time I smack it it falls off the wall so I just leave it on but anyway it, here's my headset it is the Astro A50 wireless headset uh really love this headset uh has surround sound 7.1 and it's really good for Rainbow Six Siege if you guys are looking for a headset for Rainbow Six Siege this is an amazing headset honestly I love this headset to death uh, wouldn't buy another headset or get another one these have lasted a long time and they are absolutely amazing and they're green and black so it matches my setup back up there. all right guys let's talk about my PC now I know it's on just a basic oh there's a trash can whoops there's a basic IKEA coffee table that it's sitting on i know i'm looking to buy another one i originally had it right here but i didn't like it because you couldn't see inside of it and there's just a cable right there i need to fix whoops uh 
But anyway, here is my PC. It has it has a baby graphics card in it, like it's so tiny. But it's a GTX 1050 Ti Super Clock. Uh, it's got an Intel i5-8400. Uh, I'm gonna get the Intel i7 uh, soon. Probably 7700K. Not real sure. Uh, it's got liquid cooling. Uh, it's got two terabytes of uh, hard drive. It's got eight gigs of RAM. Uh, we're gonna upgrade to that to 16 gigs probably. And this case, I absolutely love this case. It's an RGB case. Uh, whenever I bought this computer, I had it custom built. I ordered only three case fans uh, that are green. And they hooked me up and gave me five. So I'm happy about that. But anyway, this is my computer. Uh, I'll list the specs, list everything in the description. Uh, I'll list everything that you see in this setup in the description. Uh, sorry if I rush this video. I just wanted to get it done and I wanted you guys to see it. But I'm going to back up and show y'all what it looks like. Oh, I really don't have this curtain like that all the time. But okay, this is what it's supposed to look like now. How bad, yeah, does this look? Honestly, I'm in love with this setup. It took me three years to get to the, this setup, honestly. Uh, I was playing on a Dookie computer. It was like, it was a gateway computer. Like, I don't think they make computers anymore, but I upgraded to this. This was my last thing that I that got my computer. I had everything else. Uh, I was just waiting on my computer. But yeah, guys, this is it. Uh, this is my 2018 gaming slash room setup. So yeah, I told you the lighting sucks in here without the curtain. But guys, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like and hit that subscribe button for me. And I will see you guys in the next one.